You rolling? Yeah. You rolling? All right, well, show me. <laughs> Look, I tried to shoot a video earlier. Uh, somebody called it floating gears. <clears throat> I've always known them as banging gears, you know. I guess there's a difference between floating and real shift and easy and then banging them, you know, grabbing them, you know. But, uh. They don't, some, a lot of people don't know how to float gears because it's, it's a matter of uh, matching your RPMs with your gears. If you try to slot into a gear that's not, the, the RPMs aren't in a correct way. I don't know how to explain that. Maybe some of these people can leave comments down below. But uh, anyway, it, it all depends on the RPMs, what gear you're in. And I just, you got to listen to the, you got to listen to the motor. Uh, I don't do it with the RPMs, uh, how fast you're going, but anyway. Accelerator. Can you see that accelerator down there, son? You see it pretty good? You got to get a close-up on it. Get a close-up on it. Good. You can't. Uh, I'm going to start out second because I don't never eat rain low. On them uh, spoiler screws, huh? <laughs> A little better. Okay. Probably can't see it, but there's a low spot right there. So what I'm gonna do, do that right there. There's a crease right here in this area. So I'm gonna pull it here. And I might have to tap it right there a little bit. See what happens.
I'll be damned. That's where the crease is, right there.
it's not it's not down there anymore. This whole area was down. Now it's just right here, just a little bit. We'll put another one right here. We'll pull it out a little bit. That one right there, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get that one out. I'll try it one more time. It's creased, it's got a crease in it. Cut the camera off and we'll get another glue on there. Hey, you raise blade, you scratch it. Put no bondo on this. He don't want to pay for bondo. Take it all the way out, dude. You feel it? Hey. You're gonna be able to see it. That's what Mark said. He said, man, it's a car lot job, man. Just get it done. Alright, done. Uh, we'll clean this up and then turn the camera back on later. So oh, good. Why didn't it give the address? Oh, here it is. Okay, the address is, uh, what's it? I got my glasses on. It's 50 feet. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Do a video of Blue taking off in his truck. People like seeing that old stuff. Yeah, buy an old Ford, it'll last you forever, is what he said. Trust me. <laughs> anyway, here's the address. Uh, was it William Pace? I think. You don't know? I think that's him. He wanted the address to... Uh, Send my code or something. But the address is uh, 5315 Azel Avenue, Fort Worth, Texas. And this zip is 76114. And I don't make I don't know if it makes a difference or not, but on the after that it says dash 1312. I don't know what the dash means. But that's a complete address. 5315 Azle, A-Z-L-E Avenue, A-V-E. Fort Worth, Texas, 76114-1312. But I'm, I'm sure that you can just put 76114 and it'll still, it's, it'll still get here. I guess we'll see what the, the 
city wants. The city of Hazel sent me this. And it's all wet. Oh, it's my first water bill. First water bill is uh, $28.37. They don't use much water here except to go to the bathroom. That's about it. It's about right. We need to go up there and pay that water bill. Anyway, we'll cut the camera back on later. I don't put no Bondo on this. He don't want to pay for Bondo. He said, man, it's a car lock job, man. Just get it done. All right, done. Uh, we'll clean this up and then turn the camera back on later. It's oh, all good. Hold on, yeah, I, call, call me over here, son. Call me over here. Why didn't it give the address? Oh, here it is. Okay, the address is, uh, what's it? I got my glasses on. It's 56. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Do a video of Blue taking off in his truck. People like seeing that old stuff. Yeah, buy an old Ford, it'll last forever, is what he said. Trust me. <laughs> anyway, here's the address. Uh, was it William Pace? I think. You don't know? I think that's him. He wanted the address to... Uh, in my coat or something. But the address is uh, 5315 Azel Avenue, Fort Worth, Texas. And this zip is 76114. And I don't know if, I don't know if it makes a difference or not, but on the after that it says dash 1312. I don't know what the dash means. But that's a complete address. 5315 Azel, A-Z-L-E, 
Avenue, AVE, Fort Worth, Texas, 76114-1312. I'm, I'm sure that you can just put 76114 and it'll still, it's, it'll still get here. They don't use much water here except to go to the bathroom. That's about it. It's about right. We need to go up there and pay that water bill. Anyway, we'll cut the camera back on later. What do you think, son? <sighs> hey, let's uh, watch this. Hey, you like that, son? I put that little ditty on the screen. <laughs> anyway, we could not paint this in the shop because it's illegal to paint in here. So, I had to take it somewhere else to paint it. And where I took it, don't allow cameras. That's just the bottom line. That's the way it is. They don't really like the camera. Turned out, turned out wonderful. I got down the first thing, which is uh, learning how to put the paint down where it ain't got metallic stripes in it or metallic flaws. This one's perfect. No metallic flaws. <laughs> anyway, son, let's get the uh, man, I sure am glad the heater works. Hey, put the cover on that plastic cover on the heater, bro. Put the plastic cover on the heater for me. Let it sit on top. Yeah, I need to put the screws back in it. Sure does work. I like it. I like it because you can turn the, you can turn this down to low and then drop the fan, drop the fan speed to normal. When it's on low, it'll, it'll, when it's on low, you drop that fan speed low, you know, and that low speed on that fan is plenty enough when you turn the gas up to shoot, to, to, the, the sensors and everything are still hooked up so it stays on. And I like it because you can then, then you can turn the fan on the high and it blows more hot air out. I like that a lot. Anyway, a lot, a lot. <laughs> Let's get this thing back together, son. So you can get paid. Oh, yeah. Well, this is it.
Oh, Vim looks nice. You ready to go home? Yeah. Shop looks nice, son. Well, let's go home. Shut the door down. Uh, let me pull that Volkswagen in here. I'm gonna pull that Volkswagen in here. Cause we got to change the filter and oil in it tomorrow. And this one goes up for sale. I know it'll sell pretty quick. All right, man. Let me uh. Let me shut the camera off and uh, well, formally, formally close the video. <laughs> See y'all later till next time. Keeping it straight, keeping it real. Limster out.